All right, once again, we are at M&D Supply, where good help is easy to find. Hey, you got it right. Frank McKinney, yeah, that's good stuff. And uh, today we're going to talk about mold and cleanup of mold and wet, leaky faucets kind of behind the sheetrock or whatnot. That can be a big problem. Yeah, well, well, plus the humidity in the area already. So you already got some dampness. You already got excessive moisture that probably you don't want to have. So you always got to be on the lookout for mold. There's mold, a lot of molds are okay. I mean, they're not going to harm you, but then there are toxic molds that can create some issues, even health problems down the road. So the things to look for is, you know, all lumber has toxins in it. And the only way a mold can grow in lumber is moisture. Once it gets wet, if it's not dried out properly, it could very possibly create some mold in your issue, in your in your house or home or apartment. Places to look for behind the dishwasher. Okay? okay. You get a leak back there. Common leak. You may not know it for a while. Okay? And if there's any wood or surfaces back there, it's going to get damp. The wood's going to get damp. It's going to and it's going to start to mold. So. And do you start smelling it? Is that how you first get your signs? It's really a lot of it's odorless. Some of it will give you a musty smell. Now we keep some products like Damp Rid. Now, damp rid really doesn't get rid of mold, but what it does, it gets the moisture out of a particular area that might be, you say, hey, this smells musty in here, like a closet or a, uh, maybe a, a, a room that you're, you're having issues with. This will get rid of the moisture, but will not kill the mold. You need to find the source of the mold, what it is. Sometimes mold has to be completely eradicated, means the, the wood has to be completely taken out and removed from the house. Sometimes you can use germicides, mold controls, different like this, to kill the mold and hopefully it won't come back. These products, the germicides and the mold control are designed for indoors, indoor use. The Jomax, of course, is for outside, which less, less issues, yeah, less issues with your health. Gotcha. But the whole big things I want to get across to everybody today is, you know, if you start smelling something musty, you, have, you might have a leak. You, know, you need to look for it. You need to find it. Find out if you got any mold issues. You might have to call in an expert to come in and clean that up. Or you might want to come in to see us and we can offer some products that might help you clean it up. But mold is very serious. It can be toxic, so you got to sure. be careful with it. And you got to look for it in your home. Make periodic checks. Make sure it keeps you ever all safe because it can make you sick. Okay. I see you got good old fashioned Clorox out there as well. Is that, uh, what the, purpose does it serve? The, is the it Clorox is actually, a, it, it will kill mildew. Sometimes it will not eradicate it, though. Right. I mean, it, it might knock it back, but mold spores can grow deep into and penetrate into sheetrock, into wood. So you have to be careful and make sure when you do clean it out, go back and check again, make sure you got rid of it. Okay. So, hey, cool. one other thing we're going to talk about is flags. I hand it to M&D Supply. American flags made in America. Made in the USA. We don't keep any <laughs> other flags. You've seen flags. No. I know you folks have. You've seen flags with that have a little sticker on it say made in Mexico or made in China. What a hoax. Yeah. Our flag's got to be made in the USA and that's the only flag we're going to sell you. So if you're got them in all flag, sizes as well. Right, yeah, we got, you know, the 4th of July is coming up. Okay, a lot of people have been coming in wanting flags for the, for the soccer game that's oh, coming yeah. up just so they can show their patriotism and support of the team. But if you're looking for flags, I've just ordered a whole slew of flags that are coming in Saturday. We're going to have an end cap in the store. It's going to have bunts, flags, pole flags, small flags, little flags, anything you want to put out on your home to celebrate the 4th of July. So we're going to have a good selection if you want to come in and take a look. Perfect. M&D Supply. Where? where good help is easy to find. There you go. Frank McCaney, M&D Supply.